the ethical considerations of using silk. So there is a dilemma. We are all aware of the dangers of carbon emissions. And so intuitively, we wanna to go towards the natural fibers and the ones that are kinder to earth rather than using petroleum-based products. So we also feel a responsibility to adhere to the standards of humane animal practices. And the Bombyx mori, the silkworm, is a living insect. Now PETA has outlawed silk in their policies. However, there's another side to the story. First of all, silk is an ancient 5,000 year old industry and many of our developing countries use it for their livelihood. Secondly, it's very good for women. It has provided an avenue where women can have independence and decision-making in their communities and their homes through this industry. So it's very beneficial for women. Thirdly, the silkworm has been domesticated for so long that it would just become extinct if it were not for the sericulture industry. The Bombyx mori, the silkworm, if it were to develop into a moth, cannot even fly on its own without human help. So do we let it become extinct? Then there's the Buddhist view. Buddhists feel that a lifetime on earth is such a precious incarnation that no matter what form it takes, it's precious. So the Bombyx mori living a shorter life as opposed to no life at all is considered better. The silkworm certainly has a good life. It's taken care of. It is in a comfortable temperature controlled environment and it's hand, felled, it's hand fed its favorite food, chopped to just the right degree. So also the silkworm does not feel pain when its cocoon is stifled. Their nervous systems are not developed enough to actually feel pain as we do. So it's a complex issue. Um, it's a personal decision about whether to use silk and one that we should all contemplate. Perhaps the answer right now in the evolution is just to appreciate it as much as we can and to not let it go into landfills, recycle it, use our cutting scraps to make quilts, and feel grateful to the Bombix Mori for creating this transcendently beautiful fabric.